The Disney Premier Visa credit card. Now, this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. I'm going to show you everything you need to know about this card, including the card member offer, the annual fee, the APR, the interest rate, and all of the bonuses. So, if you are interested in learning more about the Disney Premier Visa card, then keep watching as this is going to be the most valuable video you ever watch. Okay, so jumping into this, the first thing that I want to mention is the new card member offer. This card member offer gives you $300 in statement credit after you spend $1,000 on purchases in the first three months of account opening. Now, this may be a little bit confusing in terms of what do these purchases actually mean, and no, this is not purchases specific to Disney. This just means if you spend $1,000 on anything in the first three months of opening your account, you will be eligible for the $300 in statement credit. Now that is pretty much 30% cashback which is pretty incredible. Uh, one of the most generous card offers I think I've actually seen which is very very nice. From here we can also see some of the other benefits such as Dream Bigger with the Disney Premier Visa card from Chase. This gives you 5% in Disney reward dollars on card purchases made directly at DisneyPlus.com, Hulu.com or ESPN+. You can also earn 2% on select card purchases and 1% on all other card purchases, which I will get to later in the video, explain more about these. And you can redeem these points towards most anything Disney, at most Disney locations in the US, and also for statement credit towards airline travel. Enjoy special vacation financing and shopping savings as well, which once again we will cover later in the video. But for now, let's move down to the APR. So we can see that we actually start off with a 0% promotional APR for 6 months on select Disney vacation packages from the date of purchase and after that it goes to a regular APR. So that is pretty handy if you're wanting to book like a Disney holiday, Disneyland, Disney World, one of, one of these options. Uh, that can be very handy indeed. And then as I mentioned, after that we go to a standard APR, which ranges between 16.24 and 25.24% depending on your credit score. We can also see that this card has an annual fee of $49, which makes this a premium card. However, I think this is the cheapest premium card that I have seen on Chase, so that is very nice right there, and $50, what's that, like $3.50 a month maybe, $3 a month, it really isn't too much of a big fee. Now, the final thing that I want to mention from this left hand side is there is actually 10 card designs to choose from, and uh, let me actually go ahead and google this, and see which card you can choose from, and take a look at all of the designs, which look to be right here. Now, when I Google this, we're actually given a bunch of different options, so I'm not entirely sure which are the 10 you have to choose from. Can we access this somewhere on the site? Okay, it doesn't look like we can. Not to worry, though, that isn't really important. However, guys, just keep in mind you do have 10 card designs to choose from if you are into getting a pretty fancy card. Now, moving over to the right-hand side where we can take a deeper dive into this card and kind of tear apart what we have already discussed. So, you do get this $300 statement credit. However, I, I do feel like I need to mention that this product is only available to you if you do not already have this Disney Premier Visa card and you have also not not received a new card member bonus specifically for this card in the past 24 months. From here we can come down to special Disney vacation financing, I mean we already discussed that down here. You also get 10% off savings every day on shopping with the Disney Premier Visa card, which means you can save 10% on select purchases at shopdisney.com when you use your Disney Premier Visa card, and you can also receive 10% off select merchandise purchases of $50 or more at select locations at the Disneyland and Walt Disney World Resort when you use your Disney Premier Visa card. Another benefit is right here, so we've already discussed the earn 5% in Disney reward dollars on card purchases made with Disney.com, Hulu or ESPN+. You can also earn 2% in Disney reward dollars on card purchases at grocery stores, restaurants, gas stations and most Disney locations. So that is pretty cool right there. I mean, groceries, restaurants and gas stations are going to make up the vast majority of your expenses, right? The final main benefit of this card is the airline statement credit, which is redeem reward dollars for statement credit towards airline travel, which for some of you is going to be super handy indeed. Then we can come down to the explore additional benefits section. Oh, there we go. <laughs> These are the 10 designs that you can get. 
So, yeah, pretty cool right there. Anyway, as I was saying, the explore additional benefits. Some of these are actually pretty cool. So, how can you actually redeem your Disney reward dollars? You can redeem your reward dollars towards most anything Disney, at Disney locations, including Disney shopping, movies, theme park tickets, resort stays, dining, and more in the US. You can also redeem your reward dollars for statement credits towards airline travel. Just purchase airline tickets with your Disney Premier Visa card for chase on any airline to any destination, and then redeem for statement credit. We can also see Disney vacation financing, I mean, we talked about this already. Disney perks. So what perks do you actually get in terms of Disney with this card? So 10% off select merchandise credit purchases of $50 or more at select locations throughout the Disneyland and Walt Disney Resort, also on the cruise line ships. You also get 10% off selected dining locations most days at the Disneyland and Disney World resorts when you use your credit card to purchase. 15% off the non-discounted price of select guided tours at the Disneyland and Walt Disney World resorts when you use your credit card to purchase. Another benefit is pause for special photos at our private card member locations at Walt Disney World Resort and the Walt Disneyland Resort. Your complimentary photo download will be digitally enhanced with Disney or Star Wars characters appearing right next to you. You can also get 10% off select credit purchases at shopdisney.com, which look, Christmas is coming up guys, it's currently September. It's going to be super handy, right? We also get credit card service and protection, so a few benefits right here, such as baggage delay insurance, which reimburses you for essential purchases like toiletries and clothing for baggage delays over six hours. And you can actually claim up to $100 per day for three days. We also get credit card purchase protection, which covers your new purchases for 120 days against damage and theft. You can make up to a $500 claim at a time and $50,000 per account. The extended warranty protection on this card extends the time period of the US manufacturer's warranty by an additional year on eligible warranties of three years or less. And then finally, we have the merchant offer, which comes with every Chase card Card, I think this effectively this gives you one year complimentary dash pass which is a membership for both DoorDash and Caviar that provides unlimited deliveries with zero dollar delivery fees and also lower service fees on eligible orders. So guys that is everything you need to know about the Disney Premier Visa card. Of course this is only really going to be worth it if you do often shop at Disney you often go on Disney vacations and basically if you spend money on Disney this is worth it. As this can just be used for so, so many things across Disney, including any online Disney purchases you use, any vacations you go on, and also you can get benefits with ESPN for all you sports lovers out there, and also Hulu if you are into streaming platforms. So if you learned something from this video or you found it valuable in any way, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, guys, take it easy.